Okay, so it is here. I'm not sure if you can see this. Let's see if I can adjust the tripod here. Bull Armory. I just now fit it in my Tinicore Curtom holster. Um, it fits. Fits actually pretty well. The gun is light. Um, yes, there are, and the battery's about to run out already. Um, the gun is light. It is uh, very short. It's not something I am used to, but I can certainly get used to it. Super light, even, it's empty right now. I'm not sure if you can see in there, but it's empty. Um, so it is light, it is empty, um, it is short, um, it's very smooth, very rackable. Uh, the very first thought when I picked it up was, oh wow, it's super light. Um, the next thought was that it's super short. Um, so if I'm holding it such as this, you can see my finger almost in front of the muzzle. Uh, so I would have to, there you go. That's a better representation of how I shoot. Uh, another thing I noticed is that I'm probably gonna have to keep this over to safety. Uh, pretty much mandatory with this gun because if I decock it, let me see. It raises up a little bit. So it's letting me rack it now, but it wasn't letting me rack earlier. Um, so there's that. There's the bobbed hammer and the bobbed beaver tail. Um, it's got an ambi safety. Um, to me, the grips are a little bit slick. I wish they were a little bit more aggressive. Uh, my hands are always pretty dry though, so ashy hands and semi-slick grip means that I might have trouble getting a purchase on the gun. Uh, it's cool because it's got a pretty decent undercut here. Um, which means I can get all three fingers to spare uh, with some room to spare. Um, it comes with two mags. I'm going to order a couple more. I'm gonna also going to order a Hollow Sun. Um, either the EPS Carry or the 507K X2 ECV, ECSS. Uh, one of those two. Um, not sure if I like... The fiber optic is good, but... I'm not sure on those are the you know nighttime you know carry gun type thing. So I know a lot of people they rely on uh, tactical lights. I'm not sure if I'll do that either. I'm not sure where I'm going with this, but uh, I do like the rear sights to blacked out. Uh, they're adjustable up and down and left to right. Um, so when you switch out to an optic. Uh, you lose the rear sight, um, but most optics actually come, so I think the optics that I mentioned actually come with a, like a rear sight kind of built in to the optic it, itself. Um, I've taken it down. I need to take it down further to thoroughly clean it. Uh, hopefully I can go to the range today. I got it yesterday. Uh, ordered it directly from Bull Armory. Um, it took maybe two days to process. I ordered it on a on a on a Monday and it actually got to my FFL on Thursday um, and I didn't pick it up until the following Monday which is yesterday because I was out of town uh, but yes this is a nice gun we're not gonna go over what's in the bag because that's that's all over the internet um, but yeah it's very nice piece of kit. Uh, what's really cool is that I can use it with my current holster.
and that is it for now.